Um, moving back to England and your non-league experience. So I see on here you played for the likes of AFC Liverpool, Lancaster City, uh, St. Helens. I don't know if I'm pronouncing pronouncing all of these right. Yeah, 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 um, yeah perfect. And uh, and Garstang FC. So these are all non-league teams or within the football realm of like not EFL teams within England, correct? Yeah, so that most actually most of those teams are Northwest counties. Uh, one of them was Northern Premier League, and uh, but between them as well, there was one that would have been in my youth career, which was Fleetwood Town. Uh, so I went over to the, I went over for a month because Fleetwood Town, uh, Fleetwood Town's academy is two minutes away from uh, my girlfriend's house. Oh, so, really? Okay. Uh, in Thornton Cleveley, so I saw that they were doing this like academy thing, and uh, I, I knew one of the people there, so I just literally emailed them and went to train with them. So they were bringing like internationals from all over the all over the globe. Really, they had like quite a lot of Americans, Canadians, all sorts coming in to train for, you know, like uh, get a bit of coaching experience in Europe, and then go back to wherever. So I was I wasn't doing anything in the summer. So two minutes away from my girlfriend, I was like, I'm going to do that. From that, then I went over to Lancaster. Uh, so one of our coaches was a coach at Lancaster City. So I went over with him, trialed, and then ended up staying. But the, um, I was I played mainly with their under twenty threes at the time, and the manager left. I think he went to a Northwest Counties team at the time. So when he left, I left as well, and then went to over to Garstang. So okay. Garstang gave me first team experience, uh, which was what I needed at the time. I was I was young still. I needed to get a bit of men's football experience and see what it was like. But during that, I went back to uni, so university. I was studying sports business at Liverpool John Morris. The okay. commute from the first time also trained in Lancaster, and it was a bit of a drive for me from Liverpool. I think it like on a th Tuesday, Thursday night, that's how semi pro schedules work. That was like a two hour drive. Um, it was very, but and if there was traffic, I literally wouldn't even make it on time to training. So I remember once, uh, me and a guy that was from Liverpool as well that I took with me to Garstang, we were in my car, we were driving over to, to Lancaster to train, and once we hit the M6, which is the motorway that connects Liverpool and the uh, like that area, uh, there was like, it was completely gridlocked, traffic everywhere, wasn't even moving. And that's when my manager texted me, he was like, yeah, you're probably not going to make it on time. You might as well turn around. Mm -hmm. So I was like, it was, I think one. it was, yeah, it was, it was tough because I was just breaking into the team and then oh, there goes my starting 11 spots because this is happening, you know? Yeah. yeah. So it took a very difficult decision for me at the time. I had to find something closer. So St. Helens was a 20-minute drive from mine, a lot closer, still in the same league. So I went, I trial. The assistant manager was Portuguese, and that's how the connection came along. And I, it was nice to have, you know, I haven't been home in a while as well, so it was nice to have people from Portugal. And we had a couple of Portuguese players as well, so I went over there and uh, played a couple of games for them. And then uh, I played for their 21s as well, because their 21s played in the Northwest Under-21 League. Week and which had like Tranmere Rovers had their uh, 21s team as well Macclesfield Town before it went bankrupt the first time had their team in there so it was a bit of a competitive league so I'd get a game with the first team on Saturday and then a team with the 21s on Sunday nice. so we lo loads of game time what I needed at the time you know yeah. get my fitness and all that yeah and then so that finished as soon as oh I think the season got cancelled because it was the beginning of COVID oh, we went yeah. into that first lockdown I think that's what it was so the season was null and voided gone never existed once again something is voided in my in my yeah. career <laughs> yep <laughs> there's, there's a pattern here yeah and that's where uh, the difficulty started uh this is where an interesting part of my career started which was finding a full-time club i've graduated from university my agreement with my dad is complete i can now pursue football completely 